Another product we would like to introduce today is a brand new combined shock or tilt detector and magnetic detector with external input. This product completes the range of perimeter detectors. The detector is equipped with bi-directional asynchronous communication, which allows remote changes in the internal settings while saving the battery. For this reason, it is only compatible with JA103K, JA103K7AH and JA107K control panels. As I mentioned, this is a combined detector of a shock or tilt and magnetic detector with external input. The detector is available in white color. In terms of functions and features, in shock detection mode, it responds to vibrations and shocks caused by the pad to which it is attached. The shock sensitivity can be adjusted automatically or manually on a scale of 1 to 10. In tilt detection mode, it responds to changes in its position. The magnetic sensor works on a completely new principle of magnetic curve detection. Thanks to this, it can detect foreign magnetic fields and thus prevent possible sabotage by an extraneous magnet. It is also possible to connect an external contact, for example a wired magnetic detector, roller shutter or other switch via the input. It logically occupies two positions in the system. This detector has interesting possibilities of use, considering the fact that it allows the operation of both functions at the same time. It can thus be used as a combined shake, tilt and open detector. Combined with shock and magnet detection, an alarm can be triggered when a window or door has not yet been opened to prevent further property damage or burglary. Or a programmable output can be activated. For example, to light a lamp using our smart plug. Magnetic contact or universal input may not always be used. Thus, the detector can be used as an ordinary shock or tilt detector to detect manipulation with the guarded object. As far as installation is concerned, Compared to a conventional magnetic detector, the adjustment of the shock sensitivity and the magnet calibration must be taken into account. All in the F-Link configuration software, of course. I believe you will love this detector.